Hello ladies and gentlemen, Adrian here for the Distril team, and today we're going to be taking a look at the view options within scanning results on Distril. So when using Distril to scan a hard drive or any sort of storage device for recovery, you get a couple options once the scan results display. And I want to walk you through the four available view options once those results come in. So for example, earlier I scanned my main hard drive here on my MacBook, and it displayed all of the results that I was able to find when it came to the files that could be recovered. Now you can view these in one of four ways. First and foremost here, we have the folder view. The folder view basically breaks it down by folders of which it's found the files in. So in this case, you see I have three folders, documents, partitions, and pictures. These are all the files it was able to recover when I did a scan of this specific hard drive. You can see you can go into the hierarchy of the folders by simply tapping down on the down arrow and then going in within each subfolder as needed. So again, this is the folder view. You can see the name, view, the hex, the kind of file it is, as well as the size. And if the modification date is included, you can see that there as well. Now, changing the view option here in the bottom right allows you to go and see it in another way. So for example, as we're viewing it in folders right now, we can also simply just jump to the file view. What this will do is just simply display only the files that it was able to find within the scan. So if you just want to get down to the files it was able to recover so you can find that one specific file or all of them, you can just view it in the file view that simple, that easy. You'll notice that the path, however, still has a folder from which it came. So you know its original location. In this case, this one came from the partitions folder, this one came from the documents folder, and so on. Now the next view is also folders. However, this gives you a more visual representation with icons. So if I go to folder with icons here and I navigate back, for example, you can see I still have my main folders, so documents, partitions, and pictures. However, when I click into a specific folder, I can see the subfolder, and then let's say I go into this plist folder here. You can see I now have all of the files displayed. However, now I have an icon representation, so I can actually see a little thumbnail of the file that I'm trying to recover. Really useful, especially let's say you're trying to recover a picture that you may have deleted and you want to see if you know you can find it via distro. It makes it easier to visually see what's being recovered and what you have options to recover within distro with this view. So again, folders with icons allows you to navigate the folder still. You can see here in the path directory, this time you just get the picture and thumbnail view when it comes to searching for your results here. Last but not least, you just have the simple icon view. This will show you all of the files that the scan was able to find in terms of recovery. However, it'll just show you the thumbnail view. So no folders, you don't have to navigate through subfolders if you just want to get directly to the files, but you want that thumbnail view and the ability to search just based off the icons, then this is the view for you. And again, once you find the file that you want to recover, you simply check the file, hit recover in the top right, display where you want the file to go, and you're good to go. And it's that simple and easy, and these are all the view options you have within Distril.